how to customize the watch faces on your Garmin Venue 2. Welcome to another Gaging Gadgets Garmin Venue 2 tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to customize the built-in watch faces on your Garmin Venue 2. And if this video helps you, please consider giving it a like and also subscribing to my channel because that really helps me out. So there are several different built-in watch faces that come on your Garmin Venue 2. And we can customize these to change the look, analog, digital, or the color, different things like that. Also display different data on our watch face. If you're looking to install third-party watch faces on your Garmin Venue 2, check the description because I'll have a tutorial going over that as well. So to customize the watch faces on our Garmin Venue 2, the first thing we need to do is simply hold down the bottom right button down here just for a second or two until you see the menu come up. From there, simply select watch face with your finger. And then as you can see, we can swipe through some different pre-configured watch faces that come pre-built on our watch. So they have some pretty cool ones, like this one's analog, and as you can see, it has some different data on it. Now, when going through all of these, if you see anything you like, just simply hit the little pencil button and you'll be able to edit that built-in watch face. But what I'm gonna show you is how to build one from scratch, and that'll give you a full overview of all the different things you can change on your watch face, and they'll be exactly the same even if you customize one of the built-in ones. So keep going all the way to the right until we get to Create Custom, select that, and then from here we can decide what type of watch face we want. Do we want a live watch face where the background will move, things like that, or a still watch face? Keep in mind the live watch face will require more battery life, so I'm gonna do still. Then we can choose the type of background. I'll do a landscape. After that, we can start editing the actual watch face. So first we can choose our background by swiping up or down. And they have several different landscapes available. I like these trees here. Once we select our background, we can slide from right to left, and then we can determine if we want to do analog or digital. So I'm going to do analog, and they have several different analogs available, like this one right here. After that, we can start choosing data. So different watch faces will have different amount of data that will be displayed on your watch face. But once you get to where you can edit the data, simply hit the plus symbol, and then we can swipe through the different types of data that are available. So as you can see, they have steps, and this one shows your goal. Stair counting, intensity minutes, body battery, stress level, heart rate, respirations per minute, calories, calendar, the seconds, temperature, your calendar, notifications, sunrise, sunset, and then they have some bigger ones that you can choose to show more data. And I'm gonna choose one of those, this one right here with the heart rate and the steps. So as you can see, I'll get all that information at the top of the watch. Then I'm right here, I can choose another one and I'm gonna do sunrise, sunset. Now that we've chosen the data that will be displayed on our watch face, we can slide again to the right. You can choose whether you want a time marker that goes around the bezel of your watch face. So if I turn that on, you can see what that looks like. So that'll kind of just show you the progress of the minute that you're in and it'll reach all the way to the end but that will use more battery life, so I'm gonna turn that off. And then finally, we can choose colors of accents and everything. They have several different colors in here that you can choose. I'm just gonna do white because that'll work best on that background. Once you're done, hit the top right button, and that'll save and activate the watch face that we just customized and built. And that's how you customize the watch faces on your Garmin Venue 2. If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more Venue 2 tips and tutorials, check the links in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up, and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, for more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.